Disclaimer. All information is directly pulled from the most current listings of United States codes at the time of uploading. No person should take the information or interpretations presented here as legal advice, or advice of any kind. All legal research or request for legal interpretations should be done individually as all information presented can be changed at any moment. United States Code Title II, The Congress Chapter 5, Library of Congress Section 132A-1, Obligations for Reimbursable and Revolving Fund Activities, Limitation The text reads Effective for fiscal years beginning with fiscal year 1995, obligations for any reimbursable and revolving fund activities performed by the Library of Congress are limited to the total amounts provided, 1, in the Annual Regular Appropriations Act making appropriations for the legislative branch, or, 2, in a Supplemental Appropriations Act that makes appropriations for the legislative branch. This means, starting in 1995, the funding of every fiscal year for the Library of Congress will be limited by the following acts geared towards the legislative branch. By the Annual Appropriations Act. Any Supplemental Appropriations Act. I am not a lawyer, a politician, a representative of the United States government, or an expert in any field related to any of the information being presented here. I am merely a concerned citizen hoping to bring the rules that dictate our country to light in an easier to understand fashion than is being presented to us currently. Thank you. Please go to the Office of the Law Revision Council for a complete list of up-to-date versions of United States codes. The link is in the description below. https colon slash slash us code Please like and subscribe for more releases and updates.